It absolutely is. Kirsten and Craig, good morning to you. And really a heroic move that just fills my heart this morning. These climbers spent the morning making their way up to the top of One World Observatory. Then when they get to the top, they slowly make their way out. We're seeing some of them right now trickling out of the building. But really, when you talk about this challenge, it really is symbolizing the strength, hope, and resiliency of the American spirit. Three, two, one. A strenuous 2,226 stair climb begins as a 9-11 hero is honored. Every step you think is difficult, and then that memory clicks in, and you go faster. Participants in this year's Tunnel to Towers climb at One World Observatory are proud to embark on a 104 flight mission in memory of the men and women who lost their battle against 9-11. What we did here today doesn't compare to what our responders, our firefighters, our police officers, everyone that, that takes care of the city and this country, what they do for us every day means so much. After a two-year hiatus, the Tunnel to Towers Foundation welcomes back active and retired first responders, injured vets, and 9-11 survivors from around the region. The foundation is dedicated to honoring the sacrifice of FDNY firefighter Stephen Siller, who laid down his life to save others on September 11, 2001. Stephen's brother, Frank Siller, is the CEO of Tunnel to Towers. What's more iconic than this building in, in America uh, and to climb up the stairwell? Because we know what those stairwells signify. The sacrifice that was made 20 years ago. For more than 20 years, the foundation has supported the nation's first responders, veterans, and their families by providing these heroes and the families they leave behind with mortgage free homes. Our first mission at Tunnel to Towers is to make sure that we never forget and that we always honor the sacrifice. A mission that lives on through the sweat, sore feet, and painful muscles of these brave souls. I lived in New York for over a decade, and uh, I think it's a great tribute to have this huge physical exertion as a, as a way to remember the people we lost. And get this, by the end of this year, the foundation will deliver 1,000 mortgage-free homes to our nation's heroes and their families. 